Hi, welcome back. So, everyone's probably already heard about this uh, from many different places, but um, the anniversary event rewards are here. And now, I was thinking there was going to be more than just the 10 wish thing, because I was thinking, wow, that's really stingy. I'm sure they have something else. I wasn't expecting this. This is just pathetic. Um, you know, I'm going to go over this. Um, you probably already heard this, but I'm going to go over it anyways. Um, hello, travelers. This is the Tivat Hiking Association, whatever the hell that is. Time flies. A year has gone by and Genshin Impact is about to turn one year old. Today, the Tivak Hiking Association has brought you a rewards preview of the one-year anniversary community events. An overyear of the events. Okay, so the first thing is a web event. An unforgettable journey uh, starting on the September 28th. Event rewards. Prima Gems, Mora, Mystic Hands Mora, here's what's. During the event, travelers can watch their own anniversary theater and relive their experiences of their journey. After watching, travelers will not only retain uh, rewards for viewing, but can also exchange rewards with their friends, such as Primo Gems and Mora. Now, I, I don't know about you, that sounds kind of, kind of weird. I, I like the idea of being able to watch uh, the theater thing, that's kind of cool. But I don't understand what exchanging rewards mean like why would you why would you trade people gems for mora but anyways um that's a web event and uh, here's the other one um a message in time event rewards blessing of the welkin moon chance to win 10 percent hundred thousand mora chance to win 90 percent now this uh, why i don't understand why they couldn't have just given everyone a welkin moon this would have been a perfect anniversary event reward. Like, just this, the Ten Wishes, a Welkin Moon, everyone would have been happy. But why does it have to have RNG behind it? This just pisses me off. Like, and, and the 10% of people, I mean, watch, the 10% of people that get the Welkin Moon are probably going to be whales. And they're not even going to give a shit. Like, it's, uh, this just, I'm so frustrated with this company right now. Just come on, Yo-Yo. Um, like, 100,000 more is cool and all, but, like, come on. They can do so much better. During this event, travelers can take part in a raffle by creating their own anniversary cards. After the event ends, we will randomly select 10% of the participants to receive a welcome moon. The remaining participants who are not selected will be rewarded with 100,000 more. And not only that, but you have to... You have to actually, like, go on their social media and basically advertise for them just to get this. You have to create an anniversary card and, what was it, post it on Twitter or something? Which is just asinine. For an anniversary, this just doesn't even feel like a reward. This just feels like advertising for MiHoYo. Just for a 10% chance at a Welkin Moon that's... Five dollars. A welcome moon is five US dollars. Like, that's enough to go get a couple burritos at Taco Bell. Like, this is a multi billion dollar company. There's absolutely no reason why they can't do a little better than this. Like, this is making the 10 wishes look good. I mean, holy crap. Anyways, let's go on with the rest of this. Now, the anniversary congratulatory art repost prize giveaway event rewards, uh, I, iPhone 13 Pro Max, uh, share daily to participate in the raffle for cash prizes, platforms, Twitter, and Facebook. So this is another web event where you have to share to get a fucking iPhone. I, I could care less about that. Um, recording your anniversary memories, event rewards, Primo Gems 100, but only 1,000 winners. And this will be on Twitter, Facebook, Hoya Lab, blah, blah, blah. How to access event through the Genshin Impact accounts on Facebook and Twitter. Okay, oh, just a thousand people for a hundred Primo Gems. Okay, Mihoyo, all right. Um, let's solve word puzzles. Again, with the thousand winners. What the fuck is this? A thousand winners out of, like, the millions of people who play? What the fuck? I, I don't get it, like... Uh, sorry, I'll try to try to calm my frustrations. Just I, this is beyond me. Uh, 
um, how to access event through the Genshin Impact accounts on Facebook and Twitter. Just, I'm not trying to sound ungrateful. I have every right to be mad about this. I've spent a year playing this game. I've spent a bit of money on it. And I think everyone is with me on this, that this is horse crap. Like, every single other... I've played quite a few gacha games. Every single other one has some decent... Anniversary rewards. This is just sad. Even even Honkai Impact. Honkai Impact is owned by MiHoYo. And they have an awesome anniversary going on. This thing, this cake, you're going to get to be able to choose a free S rank. Um, there's going to be like a bunch of wishes. Some really nice, uh, hard to get materials. Like there's a Honkai cube down here. Sorry, I couldn't find a better picture than this one. Um... And here are the S-Rings you get to choose from. I can't choose between uh, uh, Fallen Rosemary and Argent Knight. Um, probably Fallen Rosemary. I've wanted her since she came out. And just like a free outfit. Uh, of course, there's like a spending event and stuff. Whatever. But um, their event is looking awesome. Like so many nice rewards coming from Honkai Impact. This is the same company. So they know how to do anniversaries. This is why this is so confusing to me. Like, if they can do this for Honkai, why can't they do this for Genshin? Genshin has made way more money than Honkai. And also, there's the firepower supply. Uh, you choose um, a certain amount of stigmas and weapons, and you do one temple, and you're guaranteed to get a new piece of gear. Now, I'm certain if, um, with this one, if you choose one item that you don't own, and four that you do own for each if you are guaranteed that item. But this is awesome. This is also a really nice thing. I'm hoping to get this weapon here. Um, or, I don't know. There's there's a lot of stuff here I would like, honestly. And then the seven day login reward. 15 wishes, an emblem, an outfit. And there's actually more than this. There's actually other outfits for free. This is ridiculous. Like... Where where's the love from Honkai Impact? I mean, I'm happy because I play Honkai, but uh, Genshin is like one of my favorite games ever, and this is just upsetting. All right, well, let's get on with the rest of the details. The promise of a worldly encounter, cosplay, submission contest, event rewards, primo gems, Apple AirPods, Razer Death Adder version two, Fateful Gift Series merchandise. This is kind of cool though. This is just like a cosplay. Submission contest. This, I, I have nothing against this. This, this is cool. Uh, cosplaying is great. Um, let's see. The promise of a worldly encounter photo submission contest. Event rewards, Prima Gems, Paimon food themed blind box full set. Trick or treat party themed merchandise set. Random character. One month subscription of Discord Nitro. How to access event. Um, so, so what is this? This is like... So you gotta like just t you take in-game picture and hope you get selected. O okay, so is this like for one person? Is that that's for one? Per oh my god! Yikes. Um, let's see what else we got here. Okay, okay, that's it. Oh my god! If you look at the ra the comments on that uh, post here from Mihoyo, the Everyone is mad. So basically, we have to work hard for the chance of winning a hundred primo gems. Yeah. Um, when you when you have low expectations and finding out it's lower, there are no positive feedback comments on this page. People are so mad. It's it's ridiculous. Myself included. I, I love this game so much. And um, I just, I really feel like they could have done better than what we've got here. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh, you should just be grateful with what you get. But come on, this is a multi-billion dollar company that's made so much off of us. And this is the best they can do? Come on. So sorry, it was a bit of a ranty video today, but I really needed to get this off my chest because MiHoYo could do so much better for a one-year anniversary. And don't get me wrong, I love this game, and that's why I'm so mad. They could give us a free five-star. 
They get, you know, from like Deluc, Mona, just like the base five stars. Would they lose any money? No. They could give us a hundred, they could give us a hundred pulls. And would they lose any money? No. It would just make people happy and want to continue playing their game. And just, this is a bad look. Seriously, like, the backlash from this is going to be so harsh. I have no idea what's going to happen, but... Anyways, thanks for watching my video. Um, please like and subscribe if you want to see more Genshin Impact content. I don't usually make rants like this, but... I just, yeah. Anyways, have a nice day.